Well, you were caught on camera, weren't you? Right, time now is 11.58 and we are waiting for the delayed 11.45. Well, time now is 11.59 and we are waiting for the delayed 11.45. And then the, uh, for, sorry, for the Corolian Express, the delayed 11.45. And then the uh, Azuma service from London King's Cross to Edinburgh. And... The early 12.08 LNER Azuma service from Leeds to London King's Cross. Yeah, we're staying for both. Okay, here comes the name service named after Camellia. Why? I haven't a clue. Eight oh one triple one. Eight oh one triple one to eight hundred two oh nine. Edinburgh Waverley. And we're staying for the next one. And we're most likely also waiting for a Paragon. Probably. On A25 next. Some minutes back. Hopefully whilst here we the training bus will appear. One of my old E three hundreds. A25 at Brayford. Mm -hmm. Only time this crossing is busy is when there's diverts. Oh. And then there's not many this time, Rome. There never is anymore. Three hours on end. Yeah, staying for a third. Yay! HO2 about six minutes away. A25 at station. Yeah. Right, we'll also be waiting for the early 12.10 whole train to Paragon service from London King's Cross to Hull. I don't know what it is, it's not been allocated in trust. RT, whole trains probably don't trust RTT.
to London King's Cross and we're staying for the Look next the one still minutes away yet many of them did you come off that then? The dark. No. Oh. A 12 minute delayed decker. Black hat to travel trident over there. Oh. Talking of training buses. There's one. There's one. I won't get very far, but it's probably coming back into base. Crossing's been down for just over six minutes. Of course, it has another at least four to go. You know, probably three trains in this closure probably equals three single closures when there's normal timetable. I think it's roughly equaling two normal closures now. Going just past the washing bra. I think it's quicker by rail. Is it? I think it's the same time, why not? Has this barrier been raised, or has there always been that like huge gap? Down to me. No, because. Was that there always been that huge gap between the barrier yeah. and the floor? Yeah, usually. So someone needs to either raise the pavement or lower the barrier even more. Please do, Dars. Finally started turning up then. Well, you know why? Sam Hollingworth's in town. You're dealing with shit yourself and waiting for them to appeal. Well, you lot the must know why are the mainline trains coming through here then? The, um, there's engineering works at Newark. There's a. <coughs> they've decided it might be easier to do it during the week. Cut the pitch post mainline during the week. <laughs> there's no thought through it at all. Train approaching. Just briefly. Here we are. Yeah, why not? Land the Green Ginger 802303. The William Wheel Force 802304. To Hold by Doncaster. Right, just after eight minutes, the barrier should be raised. Eight minutes till the next one as well. There we go. Barriers were down for a total of 8 minutes and 20 seconds. One eighty one oh five if we don't see it or it's one eighty one oh five and about twenty different coaches of it. So 18105 is
Well, I'm focusing today. 180, 105 is four coaches of 180, 105 and one end of 101. Five to London King's Cross. FLB. East Midlands Railway Service to Peterborough. Just thinking, seven six eight one of yours, is it? Nope. Seventy six was also one in local. Mm. All I had for training purposes, since we lost the LX three hundreds, was darts, which I think are older, just than the LX three hundreds. And the one we had for a little while off of Barnsley has gone back home to Barnsley. I didn't see it. I'm quiet now. Hmm. So something happens. That's why there's nobody this... The old world turns up to see what's not. Well, there's nobody this side, that's what I mean. Where's the chieftain? On the rails. Hopefully still moving. We've got to have another blockade for eight hours again. Fuck that. Uh... Yesterday's train report the front row at 14.55. Didn't get a team till after seven. Wasn't shunted out of the way until about half past eight, I don't think. I should have shunted at half past seven. Sat there overnight, moving to Peter for 3 a.m. Hopefully, all of that nationalised delight. Fred Allen's not bust yet, but soon will be. There it is. Got 516. Literally. to Peterborough. Change it. Sleaford for services to Skegness. The Highland Chieftain. Expected to pass in approximately five minutes. This train is full and standing. Is it? Mm-hmm. Full and standing off of King's Cross. He's not made any major stop except for Peterborough to pick up only. Well, we've got everything else ready for the next train. This is Saxelby as well. 
like it's like Sloan side, but 15 minutes away. Place on it. Everyone's in a three. Eight hundred one zero three to win for this fight, Edinburgh Waverley. Thanks girls for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Any misuse please, what's going to happen? Because we're not going to hang. <laughs> we look up at it as it's coming down. Yes. The fellow looks like I'm fucking dizzy. Approaching slowly 1246 for the 1253 Grand Central service from Bradford Interchange to London King's Cross. Which bits were passing numbers I don't know because I failed maths twice. But it's 1253. When that passes, we'll probably be staying for the sand train. Meffringham. One oh eight to William Shakespeare. What William Shakespeare's on this train? <laughs> Guns Tesco's. Yeah. Island Chief Tim was five minutes early.
Four and a quarter minutes. It's the only one as well. <laughs> one eighty, one oh eight, William Shakespeare. Who has nothing? William Shakespeare has nothing to do with Bradford, Sunderland, York, or London. Because his base is Stratford, and he's nowhere near. Approaching 12.55 for the 13.19 service from Middleton Towers to Mont Breton, which is expected to pass in approximately 10 minutes. 10? Yeah. Because of, of the extreme pathing, because there's a fuck all else. That is 10 minutes. It was 16 minutes early out on Middleton Towers. Mm. They didn't stop in Peterborough, it should just believe in the now we did. I haven't given root for it yet, I can just put these down sat here. Because I'm not going to go to the top line <coughs> get around the northern wind of platform 5. It's saying that he's, he's at the signal round there. Got a bus back. You know what, you used to be able to see round there from here. I see nothing now.
Oh. Since how long have you had a bus going to Maining? Excuse me? Open date is shanked again. <laughs> Our current service is going off to London recently, you know. Oh, was that great big mix up? Yeah. I mean, the open data went too open. No, you had some of my services tracking around here. Mm. 25 to Canterbury Hospital. Of course, it's a stockport shown at Curtin Lindsay. I had Blue Star passing me. Oh. Blue Star of Southampton. Plus the Cleef. <coughs> So pretty much it all shifted north and buses for Scotland were in Iceland. <laughs> or well, something like that anyway. Well actually I had um, 37198 which was tracking us four to Cleefops mm. just down the road from me. Mm. The Cleefops bus and the Blue Star of Southampton. What a pain in the ass. It's a fucking thing here, yep. Yes. Fuck for that. I'll be off on the upline. Had one of my recently transferred Omnicities tracking us a bus from Brixingham. Um, Where's Brixingham? Near Exeter. Never heard of it. I know a lot of the time, the 11 off, the 1 off Canterbury sometimes tracks us the 1 to Eastbourne. Mm. Do you have 66705 Golden Jubilee? Doesn't matter no more, does it? They never put the flag back after it was apparently tagged. When it ran along the fence. That was Selby Felixstone. Way back when. That's when freight did serve my life properly. I only, I only occasionally get an engineer's or light like engine movement. That took forever. Five minutes for that pocket. And? Get them out. So for one train, the barriers were down for... Six minutes. Over five and a half minutes. I've not noticed it's gone yet. I'm approaching six. Mm. Uh, unless we're waiting for 14.85. Right, oh, you can fuck off with that. It's moons away. It's a pie one. Mm. Wait for that. There we go. It would have been a 14 minute closure. Oh. We're barely up for five minutes. Or even one. Thirteen oh one for the thirteen oh four freight line so from the Tinsley Intermodal Terminal to Felix O North. Passing approximately four minutes. Maiden Sheffield's not running. Maiden Sheffield after all, is it? Yeah, so after this, there's no, not much freight for a bit. In fact, hardly any. That's probably yesterday's fuck up, bloody hell. In fact, no freight at all. Mm. And look, the rail response time's shortened a lot. And the, crossing's not, and the crossing's not even broke. If that freight travel with its destruction yesterday terminated 11 and a half hours late at Peterborough, not even halfway. How late was the 56s? Not 11 hours, about 7. Yeah, of course, there's a narrow rail fan now. Yeah. Mm. Got to come off to break, going for another. Well, they come to fix anything. Mm, you never do. County Cups. 
cups for the county. Now, what kind of make cups do they make there? Oh, uh, trophies and shit. Yeah, uh, not not cup cups. Just want to drink out of a trophy. Lincoln FC probably would. Well, not knowing their track record for this season's sidings about them, they had the disaster last time round. Their star player was locked up for offences to do in the bedroom department. Oh. And the club knew of that when taking him on. Didn't fulfil the contract of more than about five months. Shouldn't have fulfilled it at all, should have stayed at Sunderland. Try approaching. Should be 66551. I know what rail cam entries are like, some people. 66987. 551. Ooh, got some new freight line wagon. Five five one to Felixstone. Well, in that time we can walk over to Brayford. Yeah. 